Hi everybody, I am here with an HSN haul and I did want to go ahead and show you something first. I have had so many of you ask me um, what the SKU number is on this sequin tool. It's like a glitter and sequin tool school <laughs> scoop set. I cannot talk. Tool scoop set, if I can get that out. <laughs> and yes, let me go ahead and share that with you. So there's the skew on that. I kept forgetting to show that and I apologize. So let's go ahead and get started. I did um, an Anna Griffin die haul. And gosh, these are so heavy, guys. Let me go ahead and open this first one. Okay, so this is a die set where when you cut this out, it will cut like a spiral, um, a spiral cut out of your paper. And you can put both ends on your card so that when you open it up, you can have butterflies and stuff flying off of it. I know it's kind of hard um, to tell um, what it's going to do by just looking at this, but I do have... Um, a little cheat sheet here to show you but all of Anna's dies come on this magnet that is um, made to put in a, a, her binders okay um, I'm sure that these are regular binder measurements in between the holes but I haven't checked them so here's the first one in that set here's the birthday cake and the regular pop-up in the set and this is what they make so we have let's see we have the birthday cake that you can see you open it up and it has a birthday cake on it that you can decorate it gives you instructions on how to do it and then let's see this is the regular pop-up which is this one right here that's the regular pop-up so there's a birthday and the regular pop-up. And this one is kind of hard to see with this picture, but this is the one with the spiral. It has a little spiral right here with butterflies on it. Okay. I hope you can see that. I know it's kind of hard to tell. But anyway, with all of her dies, you get like a cheat sheet and then a set of instructions on how to use them. The second set that I purchased was... This right here, and this has the main die with a concentric die in the middle. Get the cheat sheet out so you can see that. So this is these are really pretty, and sometimes looking at them like this doesn't do them justice until you see what it can do, right? Okay, so. Here we go right here so there's the one die what it looks like and this is your second die right here what it looks like very pretty though okay so she actually let's see that goes to another set then we have this set right here and I did get this one on auto ship um, just because I really like the other ones that are going to come in the auto ship they're really pretty okay so here we go with this and you can use this as is like on the front of a card or you can use it to fold these sections down okay and that makes them come out like this when you fold them down i hope you can see that okay so there's that one in the cent like the center circle here that's what you place in the center to put your folds under to hold the folds and you just pop out the folds to open the card it's kind of like a handkerchief die almost okay and then we have this one here i know guys i went crazy i can't help it i love her dies the quality of her dies is just unbelievable so look how pretty these are. Very pretty. You get your um, your concentric dies that go in the center. Okay. 
And then this is what they look like cut out. There you go. And then we have these mini dies. She has a large set that I have had already purchased in the past. And this is the mini set. Look how pretty that is. I love this one with the bow at the top. Very pretty. And then we have this right here to show you what they're going to look like when they're cut out. Okay. So there's a total of three dies there. And then last but not least, we have this die. Look how large that is. And then these two smaller dies. Okay. And this is what they look like cut out. Okay. All right, guys. And I did want to go ahead and address the Tuesday morning situation. Um, it's sad, but... We have uh, several in my area, I'm going to go ahead and say, that are have already shut down or are shutting down. Um, I know of six in this area. And that's just like, if you take, I can't even get that back in there. I'm not going to try. Um, if you just take everything east of me, it's, you know, within a 20, like 20 mile radius. I have five of them that are shutting down. And that's just what I know of. So they've been in trouble in the past. They've always, the last time they were in trouble, they got a new CEO that cleaned up all the stores. I'm sure you guys remember when they cleaned up all the stores, they started relocating some of the stores to more visible areas by your malls, etc. And yeah, that was the last time and it was looking good um, until just recently. So anyway, I did want to let you guys know that, yes, some of the stores are shutting down, whether we like it or not. So um, anyway, thank you for joining me and I hope you enjoyed this haul. Um, hopefully I'll have some projects up soon for you guys to take a look at. Thanks for joining me, guys. Bye bye.